All right, guys, I'm back. And in this video, I'm gonna be ice fishing. I know it may seem pretty surprising, uh, especially me being from the South. I live in central Arkansas. So yeah, I'm surprised we're gonna be able to do this. It's been in super cold all week, single digit temperatures, low single digit temperatures for like three days. It's actually warmed up a little bit. I think it's probably 35 right now and it was 35 yesterday, but we're gonna try it here. Uh, here's what we're working with. We have our bait. We have our ice, <laughs> our ice tool, with just a hammer, and uh, we got a rod. So let's try to ice fish in Arkansas. I did this years ago when I was a kid um, at this spot, but I don't know. We'll see what we can do. It's thick enough. I mean, I'm standing on it right now. I think it's gonna be all right. So, anyways, let's give it a go. All right, guys, we're back. We got our hole dug, and there is plenty of ice. I mean, what is that? Three, four inches? It's not super deep right here. I mean, here's my dock right here. It's like the bottom is like two or three inches under the ice. So, not super deep here, but I think we can get a fish out of there. What do you guys think? And by the way, that's all frozen over there. That's not open water. So, and who knows, maybe I will be able to go a little, little bit further, but I'm going to try right here so I'm a little more confident. And man, that was a workout with that hammer. But anyways, let's go ahead and see what we can do. Well, guys, we're set up the most ice fishing way I know I can. I have some ham here and we have our giant, way too big of a pole for ice fishing. But hey, we, we're making it work. All right. We're gonna catch us a fish. I think I'm gonna throw some of that in there. Let's see. Oh, shoot. We just had a bite. Okay. I was not ready for that. There we go. We got him. We got him. Look at that. Ice fishing in Arkansas, and we actually caught one. Get back behind the camera here so I can see what's going on. Look at that. Nice little bluegill. Uh. Well, can't get the hook out of him. Whoops. All right, let me get this hook out. Here we are. First one. Check that pretty guy out right there. That's awesome. Let's let him go. that the hole wasn't going to be big enough but uh clearly it was just barely especially for one that size that was a good one that was a keeper all right well we got our first one down it was a success so let's see if we can't replicate that all right guys well we got our first one um i'm kind of trying to wash my bobber here I don't really have the proper ice fishing equipment if you haven't been able to tell. It is freezing out here, but uh, we're getting it done. I can't believe that actually ended up working out. That's awesome. But uh, we're going to keep giving it a go here and see if we can't get a few more. My goal now is to get at least, you know, maybe two or three. That'd be awesome. So, hope you guys are enjoying the video. Let's go ahead and get back to it. All right. So, I think I'm going to start packing up here because it's been probably 40 minutes since the last bite and my hands are getting cold i didn't bring my gloves with me or anything so real quick i'm going to show you guys what i was using so i just use this hammer here to break a hole in the ice and i really didn't you know expect it to be as thick as it was it actually is pretty thick probably three or four inches thick and then i used some ham and cheese loaf 
as uh, some bait and i have just a bobber with a regular pole because i don't have an ice fishing pole or anything or any ice fishing gear as far as that goes but um yeah i mean that was super awesome that i actually caught one but uh i hope you guys enjoyed and i'll probably be back doing this i'm still watching my bobber here i thought i seen it move but i hope you guys enjoyed i'm definitely going to be back and doing this again maybe this evening or probably maybe tomorrow so yeah i'll catch you guys next time and remember be safe on the ice you got to be very careful especially here in the south so hope you guys enjoyed peace out